Before we get into the news, don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with our videos. Thank you. The initial investigation into the cause of the fire at Scotty's Castle has recently concluded. The California Department of Forestry and Fire Protection, aka CAL FIRE, determined the fire began inside the visitor center. The investigation was not able to determine the cause of the fire. The fire started the night of April 21st and 22nd after all personnel had left the construction site. No generators or equipment were located where the fire started and no electrical power was connected to the building. No lightning was reported and there was no evidence of arson. Scotty's Castle's visitor center, which was the site's garage and workshop in the 1920s, was badly damaged by a flash flood in October of 2015. After several years of work securing funding, preparing designs, and conducting environmental compliance, construction started last November. Flood repairs were 37% complete when the historic structure burned down. Death Valley National Park Superintendent Mike Reynolds said, quote, we hope to be able to reconstruct the visitor center. The garage is the building closest to the parking lot. Its loss leaves a gaping hole in the historic landscape, end quote. Scotty's Castle is formally listed on the National Register of Historic Places as Death Valley Scotty Historic District. The garage was built in 1922 and functioned as the workshop to support the construction of the district. After a two-month pause due to health risks, from wind blowing asbestos from the visitor center debris pile, work has now resumed on other flood recovery projects at Scotty's Castle. The flood control project should start in the fall, along with several smaller projects. The historic district is scheduled to reopen in 2023. Park staff are currently working on plans for visitor services now that the visitor center has burned down. Thank you for watching our video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and make sure to hit that notification bell so you know when we post a news story. Thank you, and have a great day.